Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Um, today, again, we're looking at the Samsung Galaxy Tab S6 Lite running Clip Studio. Uh, somebody in, in one of the videos asked me how big a file, how big a canvas, and how many layers I can get going on Tab S6 Lite. So I decided to hook up an uh, external drive uh, that has my work files from my work computer desktop uh, with like 32 gigs of RAM. So um, let's see if uh, one of the biggest files I have opens up. Um, the thing is, uh, it's kind of convoluted to try to import files. What you have to do is get to go through this menu here, uh, file import, and then you gotta, you know, go through this own menu. Uh, you gotta go through this thing here, and then you gotta say import. And it takes you to this file explorer thingy, um, and you can find uh, your. Um, so here's my Samsung external drive. It's it's basically got a Samsung uh, NVMe, not NVMe, but the SATA SSD inside this enclosure. That's why it's calling it Samsung, but. Uh, Anyways, so you gotta go through that thing and you gotta click on it and then it brings it into, I guess, the internal memory and then you gotta then go to, um, I don't even know how to cancel a lot of this actually. <laughs> uh, it's so stupid. Uh, okay. And then, okay, let's say, screw that. Excuse me, sir. Uh, and then you gotta go to file open. And it'll like, these are the things that are imported. And I think the biggest one I have is this packaging illustration I did. See if it opens it. Um, Zamo. Spinning wheels. Hey, it opened it. Okay. Uh, let me see how many layers I got going on this thing. So that's, that's just the, um, ah, it's hard to see. Okay, if you see my head, I am sorry, it's, uh, let me bring it a little closer to me, because my eyesight's terrible. Um, let's see how many, whoa, okay, so it's, it's pretty big. Uh, uh, stop it, don't, 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 uh, shoot. Okay, so, I got a lot of layers. In that just one, that one, that's the layer. And then, I got another I don't know what this one has. Let's see. My fingers are too fat. And this one's not that big because I think this was a... I don't know what the heck that was. But, uh, yeah, I, have, I created a file a long, long time ago. So this this canvas is 6,000 by 4,000. But the, the line art is vector. Or I did it in a vector layer. Ah, yeah, it's struggling. Woo! And uh, let me see if I can uh, uh, make it full screen. Hello, there you go, thank you. And so the details quite big and you can see all these little elements are different layers like the shadows and whatnot. And, um, and like all these lines are individual vectors that I did in vector layers. So I actually manipulated them uh, one at a time with different, uh, I first drew it and then I went in uh, with the object selector and then, you know, made it bigger and smaller or whatever. And so it's pretty big file. I don't even know how big it is. Uh, let's go to File Explorer. <clears throat> see, actually, let's uh, use um, File Explorer and see how big that was. Mm, blah, 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 blah. <coughs> Maybe it wasn't that big, file size wise. Yeah, it's only like 23 megabytes. So it's not, I guess it's not that big. I think there, I have bigger um, ones elsewhere. 
it's just the most complicated one. I don't know if that makes sense, but uh, 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 the idea, I guess, I I want that this was potentially going to be blown up really big, so I I, I did the line art and vector. The shading you can do it in master because they you know doesn't have to be super crisp. The line art has to be crisp, so I can potentially make this into like a you know eight thousand by or ten thousand by whatever file and hopefully the vector keeps this uh, vector cleanness I don't know I don't know what I'm trying to say okay so let me uh, see if I can just draw on it uh, oh, I'm not in <laughs> I might have to pick up a brush or actually go to a layer so let me create a layer and uh, let's uh, just red because like, then I can see So yeah, it works. Um, obviously, it's not that I, I have a lot of layers, but it's not super big in size, so it's not going to impact the RAM that much. Let's let me close this. No, please not save. And let's open up something a little bigger. I think open. I think this guy might be bigger. Yeah, it's taking longer. And this one has a lot more nested. It's still 6,000 by 4,000, but you see all these layers? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. I got 8 layers, and each one has like 5, 6, you know. Because um, each individual um, one has layers. So that's a much bigger file. I think it's like 100 megs. Hold on, let me let me go to the uh, file explorer. Um, wait, uh, I don't even know. Wait, I'm I'm pretty sure it's 100, 100 ish, 100. Mm, that was mm, that was this this file new concepts and 97 megs so it's almost 100 all right and so let's see how this does with a new brush and new layer yeah it's fine I can, I can, I can, I can still, yeah, with all that stuff, it's still working. I mean, that brush really slow. I said it really slow and it's really huge. Yeah, it's working fine. It's, it's good. It's good. It's good. Um, so, uh, it, I mean, this is the stuff that I did at work. On a you know big desktop with um, like six cores, Intel processor, Core i7 with 32 gigs of RAM and blazy blazy, and it's opening up fine. I mean, I I I think what that's saying is theoretically I could have created it in this and done the work here, maybe. <laughs> okay, maybe it wouldn't be as fluid. I don't know. I mean, the that new layer I created. Seem pretty fluid. Um, so let's see. Get uh, rid of that, uh, please. Oh, can't see. Uh, come on. Okay, there you go. So no, it's 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 seems to be fine. It seems to be fluid. I can I can make marks, no problem. So if I if I'm making adjustments to this illustration, ah, uh, come on. You know, let's see if I could, you know, let's say I grab a airbrush and, and oh, well, two, oh, that was a huge airbrush. That's, that's giant airbrush, 1400 pixels. Now let's uh, <laughs> take it easy there. 
Let's do something a little smaller. Okay, so so I can yeah yeah it's it's, it's fine it's great it works it's uh, no problem so theoretically I could have created this file from scratch in Android you know and done it I guess that's the conclusion uh, so if you have any you know this is and this is not the I don't I also have the uh, uh, Tab S6 and which has double the RAM and way more pro powerful processor um, and you can get those I got that for 500 uh, 50 bucks uh, brand new because obviously S7 came out so S6 is on uh, discount I'm returning this as Tab S6 Lite because I wasn't able to find that S6 for such a great price so my point is even if this mid-range is working that great with 4 gigs of RAM right uh, then the 8 gig S6 should be fucking great um, I could I could probably if I was a younger man with a much better eyesight I could probably just use that as my, my main machine uh, but you know now I'm such an old guy so I need giant Cintiq but if you're a younger guy uh, the Clip Studio will work fine on Android you can do professional level work, no problem. All right, so hopefully that answers some questions for you. Uh, uh, see how big you can get with your Clip Studio file on your Android tablet, and you know, let me know in your comments, maybe. That'd be fun. All right, thanks for watching, take it easy.